guys and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm doing something a little different. Um, makeup lovers, I am sorry this is not a makeup video, but I have gotten requests of how I keep up with my red hair and I just thought I'd share some tips and tricks for who is ever out there. I mean red is such a struggle. If you have red hair, you know how much maintenance this is. So I just thought I'd give you guys a little bit of tips and tricks of what I like to do, some of the products I like to use, um, how often I dye my hair, etc. So stay tuned for this video and please make sure to like and subscribe. Ring the bell on the bottom so you get post notification updates. I'm going to be uploading quite a bit here. So let's join in together. So I'm going to pop some clips in here of me um, coloring my hair and then some clips of the shampoos that I like to use. So it's kind of going to be like a little bit all over the place because I film half and here in my filming room and then half in my bathroom because I was coloring my hair. All right, so we're taking the Matrix So Color, the 6RR and the 6RV, one ounce of each. And then we're going to mix it with the Matrix 20 volume, two ounces of that. And then I think I should give a little quick disclaimer. I am a licensed cosmetologist. I have been since 2014. So I am allowed to get access to these types of products, the professional hair coloring products. Please don't try this at home. Um, we are here to help you. Us hairstylists are here to help you for any of your hair coloring needs. Um, I know it's not easy to just get the color that I'm showing you, hence why you can just come and see me. But if you are at home and you do have access and you are a hairstylist, uh, like I said, I use the Matrix So Color Hair Color 6RV and 6RR equal parts and 20 volumes. Simple as that. I get stopped pretty much everywhere of what color do you use on your hair or what is your hair colors named or I love your hair so much. What do you use on it? That is so simple. My formula is pretty basic. It's been this way for quite some time. I've kept the same formula and personally to me the matrix hair color is amazing i cannot find a hair color that stays like the matrix i've tried redken i've tried pravana i've tried so many different color lines and they're all awesome color lines don't get me wrong i love them in so many different ways for different people however for red i know what i like and i like the matrix and that's just what i stick to so I'm going to wash my hair with the Matrix Total Results Keep Me Vivid Shampoo. In between my hair color, I usually use the Gem Lights Color Wash Cleanse in Color Shampoo. I usually use this at least once a week and then uh, use the other shampoo the other time. Alright, for shampoo, um, you guys saw that I like to use the Matrix Keep Me Vivid. I will use that, you know, once or twice a week. Um, but if I definitely need a refresh of color, I go in with the Gem Lights Color Wash in the shade Ruby Red. It's literally just pure red madness. Looks like a murder scene when you put this all over your hair. I always, always, always use gloves when I'm in the shower using this product because it stains your hands. But that's fine because it stains your hair too. And then sometimes what's cool is even if you do have your roots showing, um, you know, a little bit of outgrowth. It kind of does stain the roots a little bit. It's just a good refresh. I newly discovered this product and I've been telling everyone about this product because it is so good. Also, this is a salon grade product. I don't know if you guys can get that anywhere. Maybe Amazon. Sometimes you got to be careful though, guys, with Amazon because they dilute their products with water so they sell it a little bit cheaper online then it turns out being like you know you get half product half water and it just doesn't perform the same doesn't work the same i always take the matrix hydrosource conditioning balm and i mix the pravana chroma silk vivids red and i mix it into a big old jar like this <laughs> So then we're just gonna put 
quite a bit of red in here and mix it with that conditioner. And for conditioner, this is my holy grail, guys. This is my holy freaking grail. Um, the Matrix Biolage Hydra Source, just for regular hair, I mean, it is amazing. Blonde, brown, damaged, long, short, you name it. This product, this deep conditioner is literally amazing. I do not use a regular conditioner. I always, always just do a mask on my hair because my hair is so dry. It doesn't weigh my hair down. I get asked that all the time. Well, if I use a deep conditioner, like will it weigh my hair down? Actually for me, I feel like this product does not weigh my hair down and I have tried a bazillion, bazillion, gazillion hair mask. And to me, this just is my like, die hard product i keep falling back on it it literally is such madness inside of this jar it's pure red again wear gloves when you are using that you can't really go wrong if you're using a red mask and a red shampoo i mean seriously as hard as red it is to keep it really just works and i 1000 percent swear by it also make sure to only wash your hair in cold water i know that it's really rough to do that and nobody wants to like have it be winter and you're freezing cold and you just want to take a warm shower put the shower head on make it super hot get your body warm but then after you're nice and warm flip your head over and only rinse your hair with cool water um trust me i hate washing my hair because i hate seeing my color go down the drain but just use cold water. I mean, I feel like truly if you use cold water, you will see such a difference. I honestly swear by that. I tell all my clients that cold water, no matter if your hair is red, but if it's like a fashion color, like pinks or blue, or, you know, honestly, like a chocolatey brown or a burgundy red, just try using a cool water and see if that holds your color over a little bit more. So I'm trying to think if there's any more tricks here. Like I said, I think I told you guys that I only wash my hair about one to two times a week. I know, I'm sorry if that's gross, but it really works. I use a dry shampoo in between those days, so you don't have to worry. I'm not, my hair doesn't really smell. I hope not. Um, but if you use dry shampoo, it soaks up all the oils. Some people can't get away with not even washing their hair one day so if that's you that's okay too um i'm just saying my personal experience is that the less you wash it the better the colder the water the better the more red in your shampoos and conditioners you're golden <laughs> let me know if you guys want to see a video on how i curl my hair how i straighten my hair which that is pretty self-explanatory but i get a lot of questions on how i do this beach wave look so if you guys want to see a video on that please let me know down in the comments i hope you guys have found this video helpful if you do have red hair or maybe if you just picked up some tips and tricks if you don't even have red hair thank you guys so much for watching please make sure to like and subscribe and we'll see you guys next time